in this video I'm gonna do something a little bit more fun I'm gonna show you how to use the while loop just like in the previous videos I'm going to uh, make a small program very basic because I want to be consistent so the program is gonna ask the user to uh, enter maybe two or three numbers and then it's going to uh, add uh, those numbers and display the result okay so without further ado let's get started so first go to app and then uh, go to program editor we are going to create a new program and uh, we can name it anything uh, let's just do uh, so since this is going to be a while loop I'm just gonna put a uh, uh, WL so while loop okay so press enter okay so now we are ready to uh, start programming okay so I always like to put a uh, clear IO okay so what this does is essentially going to uh, make sure whenever we run the program or whenever the program runs it's going to uh, open in a new uh, window or in a new page okay so after this one so I already know uh, what I'm what I'm going to do you know I have the program plan in my head already so I'm gonna start with my loop so first thing first uh, you need to uh, uh, give uh, a initial value okay and uh, for to do that we are going to uh, make a variable okay so this works a little bit different than you might be used to okay so I'm gonna put that uh, one here and store this in a variable uh, can be anything I'm just gonna uh, call that one a okay so this is like my initial value right here and now I'm gonna put out my condition which is while so while a is equal to one, so this is my condition right here. The initial value uh, is uh, set to a uh, is equal to one, and now my condition is if or as long as a is equal to one, then uh, I want the program to to uh, to do this, you know. So as long as a is equal to one, then uh, I can start, you know, uh, write, uh, writing my codes. Okay, so I had to pause the video because my videos have been too uh, too long lately. So I don't want this to be a, a 30 minutes video. Okay, so I went ahead and I uh, uh, wrote the code. So I'm going to go over each line and, and explain to you uh, what I did essentially. Okay, so first uh, we uh, uh, set our variable here. Uh, the initial value, we gave it uh, 1 to, uh, to it. And uh, the variable is A here. And uh, this is the condition. Okay, so as long as this condition is true, then the program is going to keep running. Okay, so as long as a is equal to one, and now uh, the prompt statement. So this is going to prompt the user to enter uh, two numbers, and it's going to store those numbers into uh, these two variables, n1 and n2 respectively. Okay, and then uh, this line is going to display uh, n1 plus n2. So the numbers we get from the user is going to add those two numbers and display the result here. Okay next so this is uh, uh to break the condition you know so i may put i put a, a an input statement here that is going to ask the user if uh, he or she would like to continue and if the user enter one then the loop is gonna run because that condition is going to be true so remember while a is equal to one so as long as a is equal to one the program is gonna keep running forever okay but if that condition is false, meaning if a is a different number uh, than one, if a is different uh, than one, then uh, uh, I put an if statement here. You know, if a is equal to zero, for instance, then I want to I want the pro I want the program to display this uh, statement right here. The end. Press escape to close. So that's essentially all I did. And then obviously, don't forget to uh, close your if statement uh, by doing an end if. And uh, you have to end your while statement as well. So this is the start of our while uh, statement, while loop, and this is the end of it. So anything ev or everything within that uh, within uh, uh, that loop is going to uh, run if the condition is met. If that condition is false, then it's gonna break the loop. Okay, so that's essentially what it is. All right. So let's see. Okay. So. Uh, as you can see here, my clear I.O., uh, like I said, I, I usually uh, like to put that at the very top. But in this case, what happened is if the condition is true, if A is equal to zero, I mean, if A is equal to one, then it's just going to it's just gonna run uh, the stuff within the loop. It's not going to rerun anything outside of the loop. So 
since I want to open my program in a new window always, so I want to I wanna put that, that clear statement at the beginning of the while loop, okay? So if the condition is met, if the condition is met, uh, if A is equal to 1, then uh, it's going to clear uh, the workspace for me and it's going to, you know, run the program again. So I'm just going to put clear I.O. here, okay? So everything looks good. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, try to run it now. So WL, remember the name, WL. And press enter okay so that's it so it's prompting us it's prompting us to enter the first number so I'm gonna put a uh, uh, let's put seven press enter and you enter the second number eight and as you can see it's display, displaying the result seven plus eight is 15 and this is the uh, message one to continue or zero to exit so if we press one enter then as you can see it's gonna go back up and it's gonna uh, ask us to uh, enter some more number again and two and uh, as as long as you keep entering one then it's going to uh, you know it's, it's, it's gonna run as long as you you would like it to run so if we press zero let's see what happens zero okay so we get this uh, statement here the end press escape to close you know obviously you can uh, exit out of it you know by even go doing home but uh, you know I just uh, thought this would be cool so press escape it's going to take you back home okay again we could have uh, used i could have done a, a, a the in input statement to make it more appealing to the eyes you know i could have used a input i uh, enter your first number but i didn't want to spend too much time on this but uh, if you have any questions uh, just make sure you put in the comment section again just uh, just play with it you know the more you practice the easier it gets the same can be said for pretty much anything really any any science or anything anything really so yeah uh, that's it for this video